Hi, uh, my name is Louis Feldman, and I am a faculty member in the Department of Plant and Microbial Biology, and recently I was also appointed the new director of the UC Botanical Garden. One of the things when I teach Biology 1B, that's we, one of the lectures we have is, uh, what ha what's wrong with my plant in my dorm room? And uh, every year students bring plants into me and ask for a diagnosis as to what's wrong. Usually the two or three things that are wrong is that there's not enough light, that the plant is running out of fertilizer, or it has a disease. The disease is not too common. It's more that there's not enough light or they haven't been giving it fertilizer. And here at the garden, I would say the best plants for students to have in their dorm rooms is our, our succulents, plants which don't need a lot of water, plants which they can leave in their room and go off Christmas time and not have to worry about uh, giving to uh, somebody to take care of. The only caution is you want to make sure that it has enough light so that your plant doesn't get tall and spindly. And every year I have students come to me in my lab and say, would you babysit my plants for me while I'm away? And every year if you come in my lab you would find a couple plants which are resting in our lab while their owner is on vacation.